Bullet is a 1968 American neo-noir action thriller film directed by Peter Yates and starring Steve McQueen, Robert Vaughn, and Jacqueline Bissett. Released on October 17, 1968, the film was a critical and box office smash, winning an Academy Award for Best Film Editing and receiving a nomination for Best Sound. I'm Jay Haynes for the Film Trivia Channel. Let's talk about Bullet. Sell whatever you want, but don't sell it here tonight. At the time, San Francisco was not a big filmmaking mecca, and Mayor Joseph L. Alioto was very keen to promote it as such. Consequently, this movie enjoyed a freedom of movement around the city that would be hard to come by today including giving up an entire hospital wing for filming, closing down multiple streets for three weeks for a car chase scene, and even taking over San Francisco International Airport at night. While filming the scene where the giant airliner taxis just above Steve McQueen, observers were shocked that no stunt double was used. Asked if the producers could have found a dummy, McQueen wryly replied, they did. Although Steve McQueen was credited with the driving during the famous chase sequence, it was actually shared by McQueen and Bud Eakins, one of Hollywood's best stunt drivers. Eakins also did the motorcycle jump for Steve McQueen in The Great Escape from 1963. From the interior shots looking forward in the Mustang, it is easy to tell who is driving. When McQueen is driving, the rear view mirror is reflecting his face, when Eakins is driving, it is up, so his face is hidden. For exterior shots, when McQueen was driving, he made a point to keep his head near the car window so that audiences would see that it was him driving. Bullet's reverse burnout during the chase scene actually was not in the script. Steve McQueen mistakenly missed the turn, but the footage was kept in the film anyway. In the restaurant scene, the live band playing in the background is the Meridian West, a jazz quartet that Steve McQueen had seen performing at the famous Sausalito restaurant, The Trident. When Robert Vaughn received the script, he didn't like it. He felt that there was no plot nor a sensible storyline. Steve McQueen, however, insisted Vaughn do the film, but he continued to refuse until the studio finally offered him so much money that he had to say yes. Later, Vaughn repeatedly stated that his performance in this film was his absolute best and contained the work which he was most proud of. In fact, Robert Vaughn actively considered going into politics later in life, but to his dismay, he discovered that people found him completely untrustworthy because they remembered his oily performance in this film. I'm Jay Haynes for the Film Trivia YouTube channel. Do you know any more interesting trivia tidbits about Bullet? If so, let me know in the comments below. I would love to hear them. Also, please do me a favor and like this video, and if you haven't, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to click the little bell icon for notifications. Videos come out twice per month. Until next time, you sell whatever you want, but don't sell it here tonight.